was sitting at home on my couch and my friend Harper texted me and she said, how do you feel about blind dates? She said, well, I have this really great guy. He's got a good job. He owns his own house and he's got biceps for days. And I was like, okay, you had me in biceps. So I will go on a blind date with this guy. I was definitely nervous. She didn't seem too nervous. The date was great. I got, we got along great. Um, there was never a dull moment while we were talking. I tried to keep the date going on longer. Um, she had rules for dating, so she was she pretty much cut it off at like three hours and was like, we'll do this again. So then we followed it up with another date. Um, yeah, that was how we met first time. But when I'd ask him, he always said the same thing. Don't want to get married. Until my own wife planted a seed in my brain, she asked, is it that Travis doesn't want to get married or that he hasn't met somebody he would marry? Those previous relationships obviously ended and now we know it was to make way for something bigger. He's finally found someone he wants to build a life with, a partner worth keeping. He's motivated to give his best self to her every day. He does that because he knows that's what she deserves. Beautiful. You look nice. She probably won't believe me, but definitely she's very strong. Like she takes care of herself. Um, part of the attraction was that you never needed the look. There's really no ups and downs with her. She's just like incredibly level headed and straight all the time. That was, that's my biggest thing, I guess, is actually just her, her consistency with everything that she does. Travis, I love you. Sorry it took me so long to realize it. And thank you so much for staying around with me. Cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you, to grow with you, and just change with you. It's going to be great. Love you, babe. Marriage is not the end of the search for love. In some cases, it's simply a governmental loophole to get health insurance. <laughs> no, marriage marks the end of searching for a person to love. From this day forward, you'll be searching for ways to love and appreciate each other as your person. It's with great pleasure, I pronounce you husband and wife. Travis, you to kiss your butt. He is my rock. I don't think I've ever felt so safe with someone in the past. I know wholeheartedly that I can lean on him and he will take care of me. He, he just gets me. He's my person. I'm a little weird. I know I'm a little weird. And it's really nice when you can just be yourself, you know, at home and he's not gonna laugh at you and think you're weird like she's weird with me she's weird with me and we just complete he's just my rock he's my guy well you know how much I love you um sorry it rained today I know that was a big bummer for us um, but I know even though you were super anxious today, you knew that what really mattered is everyone being here and having a good time. As you know, I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. 